Take it away from me. Kill me. Kill my dark rye. You got to. You have to. Do it. Blizzard burn. Yes. Yes. He's in action. Okay. He's up. GXM. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. Put this up in there. I can activate this effect if there's an energy down there. I think... No, there... What the... Yeah, there is. But I need a space for something else. Glutton GX! We're gonna do it! We are gonna do it! Glutton GX! Right there. And we're gonna use Glutton GX. Well, hello, Rikos and the Frenchals. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. And on today's menu this Sunday evening, I'll be serving you... How to pull off Guzzlord GX. Oh yeah. You might already know about this card. I mean, check out his hit points. Check out this energy cost. Check out the damage and what Glutton GX does. It is an amazing card. It is one of the most fun cards in all of Pokemon. This is something that was like, wow, this was fun. This is cool. You should definitely try this out once, man. It is amazing. But how do you do it? How do you get a 5 energy attacker going? <laughs> I'll show you how. And I'll give you extra ways how to break the seal too. So, uh, you know, I'm gonna explain to you how this version worked. Of Guzzlord GX, you're gonna see it in 3. Oh yeah, 3 what? 3 awesome matches. So, let's get started. Today's intros is Gamers from the Anime Gamers. Where you can see love romantic comedy between Kaita and cute. Karen, I don't think you can describe it that way, Donald. How about you talk about Guzzlord for now? Okay, Guzzlord GX, let's talk about you. Let me tell you about the story. Guzzlord is a seal, very powerful ancient demon that will grant you great power if you can break all five of the seals. It has five seals on it. You can cheat one of the seals with the double colors, but you'll get a huge reward if you can break the fifth seal with all darkness energies. Let me start telling you how, okay? So, first of all, we can't do anything with this unless we break the Ancient Seal. So we have a special uh, unlocking device, the XP Share. If you attach this to this mighty demon, when your Pokemon gets knocked out, it will pass some of its energies and help break the seal. So, what does XP Share do? Equip it to the Guzzlord. When your other Pokemon goes down, you can pass one darkness energy onto your Guzzlord slowly but for free, charging this 5 energy up. So that means you can fight you know, combat in the meantime, while Guzzlord will eventually come into battle. Yeah, that's all you need to do? No, we have a little bit extra. We are running four Wish Batons. Oh, what is this? This is like a organ donor contract. I'm sorry, energy donor contract, yeah. When you attach it to your other Pokemon to say that uses three darkness energies, when they go down, you can uh, donate those energies onto one of your bench Pokemons. Three. So if you give three darkness energies onto your Guzzlord, that greatly, more than halfway, breaks the ancient seal. Ah, you see, and it's completely, you know, free. You don't really have to give Guzzlord any energies, and it will slowly come into play. And once you release it, here is what you get. You get, pretty much, this is stage 1 X GX XP. Yep, no other basic GX has as much hit points as uh, Guzzlord. Actually, there's one, it's wishy-washy. But this is number one basic hit points for GX in the entire game. All right, what about Tyrannical Hole? His first attack, once the seals open, it's like, all right, you passed the test, you have freed me, I will destroy your enemies 180 damage, which one shots other basic GX Pokemons. With a choice, man, which we were not gonna use. It can even get stage one GX, but five energies. Oh, oh yeah, you're gonna get a lot of damage. Very few Pokemons, yeah, will survive this, so. You will get a big payoff in stats and damage once it pays off. And finally, it's probably the best GX in the game. This has a such big reward for Glutton GX. A little hundred damage. Yeah, it's two hit potential. But if the opponent is knocked out like this, you take two prize cards. 
extra prize cards are probably the most powerful effects in the game. They're very limited. When if you pull this off, say on a GX Pokemon, you can get four prize cards, which I probably tease you. Four prize cards. You only need two left to win after that, which probably a tyrannical hole can take care of. This is really, really good. Really powerful. Really fun. Like if you want the all end game reward, like big reward, this is it right here. So, you will destroy your enemies with the Glutton GXC. Alright, so, once you break the Agent Seal and God's Lord, you're gonna have a very cool time. So, what do you do in the meantime? Oh, yeah, well, we're gonna have to get Barry Master out. Barry Master's like, oh, Donald, I'll help you break the Agent Seal. Yes, let me help you set up. You trade me anything, I'll give you two special berries. Give him any guard, he'll give you two of kind of random berries. However, they're of equal value to you whenever you trade them, so you actually get profit once per turn. And what else does he do? He's like, all right, you know, me and the berry squad will all gang up together and we'll beat up the bad guys for you. Uh, okay, so the berry squad's basically all your bench Pokemon's 20 damage for each one, and it goes up to around 120 for full bench. This is extremely easy to do with this deck because there's a little book trick. You can trade him, uh, he has a special deal where you trade him a Dark Rye Berry, as well as a Darkness Berry, and he will give you a special ritual. I was like, alright, I'll bind a powerful ghost to eternity to serve you, at least until the end of the match. Which is this guy right here. He's like, alright, I will serve you forever, Donald. Restoration! If he ever goes to the discard, he'll come back with a third of his power. So, comes back, gets a Dark Energy, yeah, then two more energies, he's good to go! So, if you, uh, your bench space will always be filled with a Dark Rye. Because if it ever leaves the bench, it's just gonna come back, making it really easy for this to go. Oh, by the way, Zor Zor Berry Master has one final trick where he has a special berry that steals other Pokemon's attacks. Choose one of your opponent's attacks and just straight use it. Don't pay for energy costs. If they have a powerful attack, say so they might have another Guzzlord. You can just straight copy it for two energies, except it's a GX. You would rather use me using this one than this one here, but if you really, really have to stay momentum, go ahead and use Trickster GX. All right, so what about the, our, our ghost that serves you eternally? Well, he happens to use three energies, so, which is good. I mean, he charges himself with one, but you can easily pass those energies back onto, uh, say, your Guzzlord eventually. And his main attack, is always a two shot. Like nothing without any help can survive two hits from a dark ride. They don't have that many hit points. So this is a perfect three shot. Yeah, and he also has a GX, which we cannot use. We really want to use Glutton GX. Okay. So that is that. That's how you're gonna do it. You're gonna fight with Zora Arc, fight with Dark Rai. You're gonna use items to pass those energies back gradually onto your Guzzlord. And once you get there, you try to find an opportunity to Glutton GX, and you're gonna win the game very quickly. So, anything else we should mention? All right, we need energies really quickly. We're gonna use Max Elixirs. These energy drinks will bring you one extra dark energy. That doesn't count during your turn. Onto your bench Pokemon, on whom? Well, probably, probably this one guy if you wanna fight. And then eventually, you know, if you got extra time, yeah, bump this guy up. Okay, anything else that's really special about this deck? No. I will say I'm this time I'm using Mallow, because you can light up any two cards you want and just pull it automatically with Zorark. Zorark, trade, and you'll get whatever two cards you want. So she, she, she's special, uh, she helps Berry Master out by loading Berry Master with the really good berries, any berries you want, for your deck. I think that's it. We are using Parallel City. It messes some people up big time. So, alright, it shrinks their bench to 3 bench space, making them forcing some Pokemons off the bench, and ruins their setup. So, that is it, I think I've talked about them. You understand how Guzzlord works, now let me show you what it looks like. Here we go. Welcome to the very first actual Guzzlord match. I'm gonna play my remix of This Is Death by Glamour, from Undertales, my particular robot we all love. Alright, so what do we have here? We, we have a lot of cards that we can play. No, we need another. We need an actual real Pokemon. So if he puts in your energy here, this is probably Retreat Energy, and he's gonna use Ninja Boy. Never mind. Never mind. What's gonna actually come out? Lapras. All right. So he had, you know, despite having many cards, that's pretty. Uh, it's not not too strong of a start. So let's put this down. I'm okay with playing a uh, Sycamore. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go ahead and sick more all those valuable cards down. Nice one, Donald. And okay. Well, this one has energy, so I'm gonna have to go ahead and uh well I can moonlight madness it. I'll go ahead and throw the parallel city down because I know it hurts him. I definitely know that hurts him. Alright, man. We're missing we're, we're missing drawing the Pokemons this time around. Okay, I'll end my turn right there. I should be safe. His stadium. Okay, he's got a Lapras. The second Lapras down. What happens? We need to fight with our Guz. No, no, no. We need to fight with our uh, Dark Rhyme. And oh my gosh, he needs to set up. No, we can fight with our Zorua. We just gotta evolve it down, fill up our bench, and that's all good to go. So, Max Elixir, yep, this is a Lapras, two energies here, you're confused, but you have full HP, I would just use Collect. No, oh, he's gonna pay the retreat costs. Okay, two energies were destroyed, yeah, yeah, that's good, that's good. Okay, so what do we have here? I have a Float Stone, a Wish Baton, I guess the Wish Baton could have gone somewhere. You take my energy away? Sure, sure. Collect. I'm gonna shuffle those cards away. Okay, so... Maybe this is the... You know, this kind of reminds me of a certain Dark Ride deck in the past. Okay. Everybody has a free retreat anyways. I'm definitely gonna try to hit the confusion again, unless... If I can't evolve it. So let's go ahead and try and find more real Pokemon that can fight. There we go, baby. There we go. We can also get... Oh, yeah. I don't want Alter of the Moon here. There's nothing for me to discard. Want Guzzlord to come out now? No, oh, you want, uh, you, we want Zora Arc to come out now. Or Banana Master. Guzzlord's in the prize card. No, he's not. But getting out the Zora Arc right now is much more important. No, it's not either. Yes, it is. This is about to fight. Oh, man, this is weird. Yep, Zora Arc, you get you out here right now. Get the back one to evolve. Discard the Dark Rye right here. Because we can get the Dark Rye with the little special energy boost. And get two more cards to get some good value out of this. It is the Guzzlord. Guzzlord needs to go down with the XP share. And we can save the Lele for you later. Let's go ahead and use Moonlight Mat. This confuse you. Mess him up. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Zorak's no longer Berry Master. You know, I got to train myself to say Berry Master. It's not there. Hi, Berry Master. Hi, Banana Master. Hi, Coconut Master. I did really good with Sushi Master, but, you know, this is how naming goes. <laughs> Call it by what it really is. Two energies up. Confuse. He has to retreat again. Look for a Manaphy. Hi, Berry Master. Oh, Berry Masters. I think there was only one Berry Master that I could pull out. We also have Lily, too, so we don't really need to pull this card. And it's a rather slow start, but we do have XP shares. I can summon the Dark Ride, but I want to just... Oh, it does have an energy. Oh, I forgot I discarded that there. Then I would, you know, I can bring it back anytime, so it's okay. I can fight with the uh, Berry Master next, or just retreat. So, you know, let's focus it on what he is doing right here. Guzzlord deck. Yep, there's Guzzlord with XP share. He found Manaphy. He found a way to get through this. But his bench base is weak. Well, yeah. He's got to use two removals or stadiums of his own. So with two two removals, you got to get that off the Guzzlord. We're trying to use our Wish Batons down too, which will definitely go into Dark Rite once we get it out next turn, I believe. Yeah, we'll get it out next turn. Aqua Patch, two Lapras. I mean, he's starting to get up good speed right now. So now he has to free switch. He's going to switch into this Lapras. If he does get another energy somehow, then I will lose the Zorark. So there we go. Does he have another energy? Did he have... He had to discard two of them earlier, which was pretty good for me. Yes, he does! But I'll XP share will kick in. XP share kicks in. And it will go on through the Guzzlord, which will probably scare him a bit. Once this thing gets into five energies, it can be pretty good. Alright, choice band. Choice bands all around. Okay. We're going to be on a pretty slow start this time. There goes the, the stadium retreat. I probably will pull the Lele down just to get the extra bench space to power up my Zorark. So now this is where you want the DCE, otherwise nothing can actually fight. You have to waste the uh, waste stuff. So what's gonna lame? Okay, Glaceon! Glaceon is immune to evolved Pokemon, which we do have Zorark, so that kinda that 
that kind of does stuff. All right, so if I get DC, that will be big. That will be very, very big. Ready? Blizzard Baron! You do have a retreat, so it doesn't matter much. Hey, doll, do you think of putting a Zooka tree in one of your Raichu GX decks? That's far off from uh, from this. I went, let me think about that. Yeah, you can do that. Okay. Poor Zorua. Wait. And put the energy out to the Guzzlord. Wait. I must have misclicked because I didn't get to take the energy. That's going to be a little bit of a waste. Let's be greedy. Let's be greedy. I'm going to play Sickmore instead, discarding my, my, my uh, stuff. Alright, must have misclicked the prompts. Here we go. DCE, bingo, buddy. Bingo. Let's go ahead and activate the effect from uh, Dark Rye right there. Restoration. Grab that energy up from you. Let's trigger this as well. Trade. Banana Master is here too. Good. You need this guard. Let's go ahead and activate another Restoration. Yep, grab that energy as well. Alright, gonna go ahead and add the another energy right here. Banana Master, gonna stick you out as well. Alright, everything's good. We can use Riotous Beating and get a, almost a two shot on this. Yep, rest in peace energy. Could've got four energies, which would've been really, really cool. But, that's okay. You can still make that, kind of, that one energy, although it does hurt momentum a bit. I must have definitely misclicked the prompt, but move on from that. Move on. Okay, so this looks like pretty solid so far for the first time. He can't attack again. So he has to switch it to this back one right there. Palkia is setting up. Oh man. We can, uh, we can, if we have Guzma, we can get that. Mana fee? Yeah! What are you more afraid of? The Guzzlord and probably the Dark Rye. How many, uh, two removals? This is the very first one. We definitely have more to, uh, make up for. No, make up for that. Let's see, uh, no, he wants to float still. He wants to prevent me from retreating. Why? He must want to use her GX attack or something. He's like, no, the Guzzlord's not going to pull out. Come out. Sure. So if Guzzlord was actually charged, though, we'd definitely fight with that. All right, 20 cards left in the deck. You know, Turbo Dark Ride wouldn't be so bad here. Got to go ahead and switch because you can't, uh, yeah. This could be a uh, energy switch. Good. Now he could use his GX attack. Now I have to I have to take the GX. I'm gonna lose this card straight off unless I don't have a switch. DC remove. Oh my gosh, man. That's lame. You're lame. I need a Guzma right here to would be a great, great counter right now. If I get it that. Or switch. I do have switch cards. Blizzard burn. No, it's not! It's not gonna be a GX. That's what we were most afraid of. I don't have a retreat. So let's go ahead and pop up the trade right now. This is useless to me. Okay, I do have a tour removal. Definitely, definitely uh, kick that in. You can't have these. I do have a DC to retreat, but I'd rather attack with that. Or I can pay up the energies because, you know, I can't afford to. I can say no to that. Pull an extra card with Banana Master. Might be able to play it. No, not going to be able to play it. I think I'll just attack, guys. Unless we do have a switch. And, a, and a something else. So let's go ahead and play Lily. Do have a Wish Baton. Okay, Wish Baton goes on here. Max Elixir. Yeah, this guy's charged up. Let's get some value out of this guy. Or we can retreat. We don't have to trade this card up. It's valuable to me. Send Dark Rye out there. Dead End GX doesn't work. Dark Cleave, take that. You won't take a prize card from me. This card's pretty important for drawing more cards, so yeah, we're gonna keep it. We are gonna keep it. Okay. Then I think after this, we'll try to charge Goose Lore up. It's gonna be a priority. No more DCs after this, so that stinks. 
But Dark Knight gets one hit KO. Yeah, time, definitely time to charge up Goose Lord. So hopefully he doesn't tour move this. And we'll be okay. It comes out. There's the switch. They're both weakened. They don't have a choice, man. Even, I kind of do want you to get my... Uh-oh. He's looking for either a choice man or a tour removal. I think if he gets a choice man, that's definitely a KO. Can I put energies any way I like? Oh, no, I can't. No, I can't. No, he's got to get the tour removal. Okay. He doesn't want the energies to be kept. It's so big. So that looks like his last tour removal. I'm going to have to find my final, final uh, uh, wish baton here. So I lose, I lose the XP share as well. So lame, you're lame, man. I want to sit. Let me set up my Goose Lord. Ice Beam GX, get me stunned. Can't attack. All right, so Goose Lord's coming up. Absolutely coming up right now. Trade. I'm running out of cards. Where's my Guzma, man? Or my Switch? Great. Ah, the draws. <sighs> Do get the Wish Baton this time. There we go. Hopefully you don't have another Wish Baton. I can keep all my energies. And Goose Lord will be ready for go in the next turn. Alright, punk. Punk. Take that. Make the magic happen. Do it. Goose Lord come back. I am so hoping this Goose Lord does not come back. We're gonna have four wish batons because man, they're taking gotta get it on there. Take it away from me. Kill me! Kill my dark rye! You got to! You have to! Do it! Blizzard burn! Yes! Yes! He's in action! Goose Lord! Okay, he's up. GXM, do it, yeah, yeah. Put this up in there. I can activate this effect if there's an energy down there. I think no, there. What the? Yeah, there is. But I need the space for something else. Glutton GX, we're gonna do it. We are gonna do it. Glutton GX. Ah, four prize cards! One, two, three, four! Oh! And energies! Elixirs! Goose Oh, that's where you were. That's where you were. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> oh, the very first one, too! Alright, two more prize cards! I mean, you got 180 damage. You probably can do this. If not, we'll start charging Dark Rye or Zorark, which may work in the next move. Yeah, if there is an energy, like one energy left in my deck, we're good. He already used his GX attack. We have a Guzma to hunt down anything else. And that's that. 220 HP as well. Man, setting this up is... We got the... Got it, man. I think this is it. I know this will be highlighted in the first seconds of the YouTube video. Yeah, it will be. It definitely will be. Oh, you don't have a one-shot KO, but uh, you gotta end my hand now. You have to end my hand. I do have counters against if you do choose to end my hand. I get the Banana Master. I get, I got, I got a Zora Arc. Yeah, I'm trying to talk in Italian voice. Any chance to heal Lego's Silver Viper deck? I don't like that combo. It looks like he's all out of cards. No Lele's. You know, they spend some even Banana Master. I think that is it. Uh, do I have uh, somebody with a free retreat? No, I don't. Let's see if this works. No, I, I've got it. I've got the, the game is already won. I just need another energy. There we go. All energies on you. Pull that out. Pull out the Dark Rye. Let Dark Rye finish it off. Dark Cleave. He's like, you stole the moment. Nope, you had your moment, man. Dark Ride needs some little help thing, too. So, four prize card. Yeah! Can't wait to see that in the video. It's definitely going there. It is definitely going there tomorrow. Oh. Oh, it's going on Reddit, too. <laughs> Ooh, that was big. First time to do it. Today's giveaway winner on the stream is KBirdTL. So he gets in the next match. I'll be using my Goose Lord deck, of course. And let's get started this remix. Of course, the giveaway winner is Ultimate Battle.
All right, let's see what we have here. Pretty good hand. Pretty, pretty good hand. Very good hand, I say. All right, in my turn, I get to go first. Let's get this started. Grass, Galissopod, perhaps. Okay, so don't sing. Don't sing. I just, I just get into the mood with the song. Vic Denny! Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Are you doing what I think you're doing here? Maybe! Okay, let's put the energy down. We definitely need to end. I may have to lose XP share, but let's keep it out. An Ultra Ball, you know, is a means to an end. It's just another deck thinner. The card we absolutely want on the bench is likely Dark Rye, but I couldn't discard that, so... Let's get something that could accept uh, maybe a second second one of these. That wouldn't be so bad. I'd like these to start off first. Yeah, two of them at the same time. So you can have this. This is for a treat. I totally should have been able to play this, but I prefer this to be in the Goods Lord. So I'll go ahead and shuffle one card back. And it once come back. Oh my gosh. No, no, no. All right, energy. Let's go ahead and activate this. I'll thin my hand down. Get this up there. You can fight. Now, if you intended to fight, I'll go ahead and switch this back here as well. So, I guess I should have played... No, no, no. I shouldn't have played that. There we go. Send the Zuru out. Baby, if you do lose this, that is going to be okay. What is going on here? Vic Dini. Vic Dini allows you to get the extra coin clips. This looks like Incineroar. What else? What other fire deck needs... Canopy. You're trolling me. There's the first two removal down. Okay. This is why we have extra two removal to do this. Butterfree. I wouldn't say he's trolling me, but Butterfree has an infinite paralysis effect. Alright, we don't need the XP share. I'd rather use this to get, uh, get my uh, get my Dark Rye out. So maybe I might have to help out Kaber since he's playing this sword deck. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and play Sycamore down. Discard the Dark Rye because you know why I need to do that. All right, first door arc. You want to go into combat? Yeah. Get the wishful baton. Get Goose Lord out. Go ahead and summon out a uh, banana master. Go ahead and summon Dark Rye out to the bench. Restoration. Grab me the energy as well, please. Here, you can have the energy. All right, get another call, banana master. What is this kind of crazy setup? All right, well, you know what, Vic Denny? I guess I could go ahead and trade that. Let's, uh, you know, uh, no, no, no. do I want to get an energy down there? Yeah, it's not windy so bad. Trade. So, Vic Denny, he can get this back. But it'll be, be added a little pressure for him. So, let's go ahead and use Riot as beating. 100 damage starting off. All right, waiting for a Guzz Lord. Okay. I know what the stick Butterfree is. It's paralysis. You're playing with me. You're playing with me, Kaber. Poor Canterfees! It evolves! What does it do? Adapt to evolution, it can evolve instantly. Are these guys... These guys are in evolutions. Oh my gosh, they're still around. They were printed in uh, evolutions. Generations, generations! So, refresh right there. Okay, choice man. Choice man! It may evolve again to a cat or butterfree. I feel a little guilty, you know? I feel guilty. So, what do I do? I think I don't want to give him these cards right here. Instead of playing sick and what I'm going to end to help him out. Okay. I'll go ahead and throw a parallel city just to mess with them. And I won't attack. Because I'm a, I'm a good man, right? No, I'm being easy. I'll let, your, I'll let you get your Butterfree off. There we go. Where's this? Cybolt Paralysis. Whirlwind. I get I, I'm forced to switch. So instead of taking away the Butterfree, I'm gonna get this let this up here. And feel the pain, man. Feel the pain. There we go. Field blower. Alright, another field blower. We can go ahead and that, Yeah. Hopefully that's the last one. Hopefully that is the last one. So we can do a little trick here. A Sorola. Yo, this looks like not, not so bad. Getting Vic Dini for the paralysis. Woo! So this is where we want to combo. We want to. We want to. Yeah, we want to. Mm -hmm. 
I'm paralyzed. Tails. Flip again! Oh, double tails. I'm feeling... Mm. Hmm. Where's my wish batons? That's my wish baton. That's my last wish baton? That's lame. It means the, the, the old one's prized up. Max Elixir. I'll get you up the normal way. Alright, what do I trade up for this? Uh, Berry Master, trade. Trade up the Field Blower or the Ultra Ball. Nah, let's pull up still the Field Blower. Nothing for that. Put this up right here. Max Elixir. Alright, get you up the regular way, Bowie. And I think uh, there's no way I can get the KO unless I switch right now. There's no way I can get the KO. So we need a Guzma. I've already played an ult I already played a card, so if I really want that KO, if I really, really want a KO, I have to switch. I think that's worth it, man. Alright. Painful to lose those cards, but you gotta, man. You gotta. You can't let this thing live. Butterfree! Take it out! Now this is where I kinda I kinda wanna let him get the, the dark rise, so I can get this out here. Those Butterfrees are tyrannical! Yeah! They want to paralyze me with the Psybolt. They want to do whirlwinds. Bring back all the cards up. Oh yeah, you don't need this deck. You don't need a... You don't need a... You don't need any uh, forms of giant plants. It's built in there. So that's the only card that comes back. I, I think he picked two. Butterfrees, they're resilient, man. They are resilient. And, alright. I got a neg maybe extra cards that can help me out. Yeah, let's see. We do have if we really want the break from the paralysis. Well, we will, we will. Three energy sound the discard. I think it's yeah. We could charge it up the regular way. So dark rye, okay. Cybolt. Oh no, it's sixty damage. Ah, it's just like the cheese. You're paralyzed. Like oh, it smells so good. Oh, okay, before we play that, let's go ahead and get those energies back right now. Yeah! Next Berry Master is now available. Two Berry Masters are now active. And with resetting all this, putting all those energies in there, I probably would land it. Unless I don't. You know, I could get another card through Banana Master. I'm not going to be stuck on cards for sure. Okay, Banana Master can have that. You know what? Yeah, let's do this. Sycamore, I don't want... I want to... Berry Master! Trade me your nice stuff! Do you want the wicked nest ball? No, that's no. We need that for we banana master, uh, bear, coconut master. So many masters, guys. Could use this to counter him. Why not, right? I'm so. Pretend I don't have any of those cards, okay? Alright! Back to commentating! Tabor's like... What was all I thinking about? You want to get my Goose Lord? No... 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 No, don't do that! Don't do that. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. This is my video. I ain't gonna... Okay. We're not letting you do that, man. Oh, I probably... I forgot to trade as well. I'll take the prize card right there. I didn't get any energies on this guy. Take my dark ride down. The minute you take the dark ride down, you're in trouble here. Yep. I, uh... I should have traded to get the energies up. Cybolt. Uh-oh. It's gonna be your last turn. You know, we can get this Dark Ride back out, so let's go ahead and trade them away. Uh, Trey, Berry Master, get you back. Do I want to parallel city him? I could. Don't need to. Alright. Let's see if he'll, he'll, he'll let, allow me to pass. He'll take this card out. 
Because if something bad's gonna happen, the game probably end after this turn. That might be it. Laurent is getting the bonus damage up. Butterfree! Butterfree beam deck! Okay. It's all coconut bastards. Yeah, it's looking good. Timer ball. Another evolution cards. One. One. Yeah. You have to use timer ball because the, the special effect doesn't activate. You can't, don't do it. So this deck. Adapt evolutions. I totally forgot that this was... There. He's taking the one out. I'm paralyzed, like just to go down there. Goose Lord comes out, and I think that is it. Alright! Good game, Gamer TL! Thank you. Okay. Now we will end it. I like your trolls that style. It's like the deck I did today. So we're gonna use Glutton GX, which is not gonna finish it off. Oh, okay. Oh, it's not gonna finish it off. I have to do uh, I have to I have to uh, bring this guy out right here. There we go. My bad. One little uh, thing right there. And we're gonna use Glutton GX to get this Victini right there. And the GX will take me two more extra prize cards for a quick victory. You are dangerous. I, I forgot it was in Generations. Yeah, yeah. Good game, Kaber. Good game. All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Look to another Zorark. GX, as well as Guzzlord, as well as Dark Ride Match. I'm gonna play my remix of Reluctant Heroes. From Not Undertale, this is from Attack on Titan. Let's go ahead and send out the Dark Ride. Very good starting hand. Very, very good. I say it was good. This is a good starting hand. Alright, so we have a lot of good deck thinners, which we'll definitely abuse. Alright, so the most crucial crucial card is probably the Zorark. Let me see if Guzzlord is in here. Oh, he's in the prize guards! Guzzlord! I'll find you, buddy! It means I can start taking prize cards extremely quickly. Okay. How are we gonna do that? You need to be on the bench, of course. It's okay to discard one energy, or even all the energies. No, let's see. Let's go ahead and discard just one energy as well as an end. We get any sort of Pokemons we want as well. I think I'll go and uh, use Banana Master here too. Alright, Banana Master, you can have this. You can have the energy. You can also have the Wish Baton. We might be able to play the card that I pull with Banana Master, but Lily on the first turn is big. Yes, I was able to get one card, which will go on Banana Master. And we're going to Lily for eight cards. That is explosive start, guys. Explosive. And this can't go into Zorak because he could technically fight, but that didn't work out this time. And alternate move can go ahead and stick that out. You know, bait him out or something, or just use it for removal. We'll just hold it. Alright, I think, you know, with... Yeah, well... That sucks for Guzzlord. Maybe Lily Pichu emojis. What? What's that? Alright, Dark Rye. We'll hold it off right there. I think that 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 bites. This is very powerful. Is very enough to warrant a, a tour boo right there. So he probably likely isn't able to attack the first turn. You know, hi sushi master, berry masters right here. Berry master. He's berry master. He's berry master. Oh, you can lele combo uh, Mallow if you want to. But Guzzlord. Lord. Oh, this is your deck video. You know you cannot have two Guzzlords in the deck. Oh, it's big dark. The other dark rye. Alright! Turbo Dark Rai! We can two shot each other. And uh Escape Bro. Hey, Banana Master. You know, yeah, Banana Master, you can go up there. You got a free retreat. And hey, yeah, my hand, let's see. I I actually had some good cards in my hand. I wouldn't say it was completely dead hand, but sure. Okay, this one kinda sucks compared to the other one. Field blower, definitely worth the removal of those cards. Now Banana Master can't retreat, so that end he ended really nicely with that. Unfortunately, right there. I don't think I should throw another Dark Ride though. I'd rather them go down like uh, into the discard straight off, so I might just shuffle that back. But Guzzlord, man, Guzzlord, please come out. Uh, it's his first turn, he shouldn't have Sushi Master. I'm gonna end that Sushi Master away. You shouldn't play that too early, too. Because you know, whatever you cards you discard is a bit of a waste. So, put that out there. Put energy out there. You want to toss this down for just, just for the sake of it? I'd rather discard that, so let's try to Ultra Ball that out or Zora Arc it out or something. I do get a Mellow. 
but let's go ahead and send another Pokemon out. Get another, uh, both, uh, both Berry Masters here. You said Berry Master, so... I'll just have to leave it be. Poor, poor Banana Master. He got everything with that nice one. So when I gave him extra cards, kind of just forced him to do it, unfortunately. Okay. Hi, Sushi Master. What's up? Play Hoopa in this deck for immunity. It wouldn't be such a bad idea. It would not such be a bad idea. Two energies right there. Banana Masters get pounded, man. He's gonna get pounded. I may at this point just Lele and Sycamore. Yeah, don't really need it. all this here. Or Lele and Guzma. Coconut Master and Guzma. Get a KO. Get a one-shot KO on... I could, I could, could go for this guy. Or Banana Master. Alright, Banana Master, I'm gonna save you, buddy. Got DC as well. Banana Master, I'm gonna save you. Hey, Coconut Master, I need you to get me, uh, get me a little... You, my boy Guzma here. Yeah, go in style, take a prize card along with it. You know, I think uh, one of these are more dangerous, one of these two. He does have a lot of bench damage, but not enough to defeat this one shot. Definitely not. Hi, Sushi Master! I'm, I'm going for you, Dead NGX. No, use Dark Leave. Finish your Sushi Master off. It's like, Donald, I'm gonna get you for this. Please, Guzz Lord, no. Can't get it out there. Can't get the Guzz Lord out there. This is, what is this? Is this Neo Lego? No, it's not Neo Lego. Is Neo Lego popular? That's why I have saved my Banana Master. And he does have Zora Arc GX, so we did not prevent that, but that's uh, okay. Let's get the Darkness Blade version of this. Alright. Guzma, no! He's like, you took out Sushi Master! I will take out Banana Master and get energy from the prize discard as well. And I get a one shot on this just because how b bad. No, oh, I want to say it, but I can't cuss in this Pokemon video. He's so awesome. How awesome. Let's say, let's say bad awesome doesn't work. Bad Apple. No. Yeah, Pokemon or something like that. Bad Arceus. He's so bad Arceus. I don't think it fits in there. No. Hey, we both can use this stadium. He really wants to remove this right here. Hey, hello again, Dark Rai. You took out. This is revenge. Fine. So be it. I'll save you, Banana Master. All right, what do we have here? Hi, Berry Master. Welcome to the party. Now I can actually get two of any cards I want by comboing with Mallow, too. I think I will. Mallow. I need this card. And probably this card. Or this card. Nah, these are the two best, probably. Likely, these are the two best. Alright, so who are we gonna trade up for this? You know, you're more rare. Coconut Master. Yeah, let's trade off our Shana. Let's trade off our Shana. And we get to activate this again. Ah, oh, it missed! But another Berry Master is now up! And we can trade this off, but I think <laughs> that's the best card pool I need there, so... I'm gonna go ahead and use Dark Cleave. Get a two-hit KL, probably more efficient than, you know, how this this one operates, the older version. One Goose Lord, Goose Lord's prize, that is correct. So, he may show up very, very late, but, you know, we don't need him. This is a good deck by itself. We can, we have a Trickster GX as well, which is... I am, well, I'm trying, I, could, well, I just know, I can already use all your attacks. We're pretty much using a similar deck. Ooh, we got the combo out. There's the GX version. So, we can actually get two more energies, but not quite towards where I can get a one-shot. And I believe the only recipient of who needs these three energies would preferably be, you know, Goose Lord, but he's not here right now. He's like, oh, wow, you have Sushi Master and Banana Master and Berry Masters, all standard chef kitchens are right here right now. Na 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 na. Restoration, bring back the energies. Filling up bench space, working very well with Berry Master, the enemy Berry Master here. We're pretty even, so we we'll have to. I likely will have to Guzma this. I mean, he's not gonna give it to me. No one can really fight except this guy right here. So, I'm I'm believing that this, this is gonna come out. Yeah, three energy is gonna retreat. Gonna use Darkness Blade. Give me half life. Banana Master putting out an extra card. 
All right, hopefully I can get the Goose Lord up in the next move or so. XP share on you, perfect. Everything's good. Everything's right. If you give me the KO, I'm gonna, like I need, I'm looking for Goose, Goose Lord. So I probably will pull this out. Oh, your turn's not over, man. Really? Oh, you had Acerola, but he's like, no, it's not worth picking this card up. I need the two energies here. Dark Rise is coming out. There's no way you can use Dead End, right? Because I'm Dead End is scary. Choice man. Oh, you are gonna give me the KO. I think. I think you're not gonna. Re I, I would. I would have expected you attack me with the Evil Tall, but maybe he's going for the straight one shot. One, two, three. That's a lot. Yeah. Hang on. One shot KO. You got me. You do have a one shot. Though this unfortunately cannot go for Goose Lord. The only card's worth is this one right here. We're done. All right. It says you're giving me this card. I'll probably have to take it. I kind of want this card to die, though. But not this move. Not this move. I don't want that card to die just yet. Like, I want to transfer that to my stuff. Okay. Let's Lele. Yeah. I want to shrink your hand right now. You have too many cards. You have too many cards in your hands. And this will give me five cards as well. It's getting tough. I'm gonna go ahead and trade right now because I don't want to draw an Ultra to Boom. This is already drunk. So thinning down my deck. Definitely could use this card right here. Definitely could enter Sycamore. No, it's okay. I'll take the two extra cards this time. I was, I'll, I'll take the two extra cards. Definitely want a two or boom. I'm, this is gone. I don't want you to keep the XP shares. That means you don't get to keep any of the energies here. That's big. Uh, Super Rod. No, how can I already get the Dark Ride back? Should I do that? I want to save this for other cards, guys. I want to save that. I'll go ahead and toss this down right here. I'm probably going to need that for the damage. So let's go ahead and activate this. Restoration! Yeah, come back! Just with a little extra damage there. Not not this time around, I don't need it, but... Activate that right away. Elixir that. Get a Dark Ride back up. And I think that's good. We can go ahead and do a second trade as well. If I really, really want to, but I don't think I just want to. I mean, what could I actually get? I don't know. Right is beating. You get to keep nothing. No energies. All those energies. Goose Lord. Oh, yeah. Wish Baton. Come out here. Wish Baton. Let's go. Wish Baton. How many Wish Batons have you used up? Two. So there's one more. There's one more. One activated naturally. He does should have another field blower. Our evil talk comes out. Very, very tough and tanky. We don't have a tour removal for that. So definitely he's just gonna switch this in. Oh, you activated! Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. I... Alright, I have one more wish baton or two more wish batons. I'm not sure, but we're gonna try to get this uh Goose Lord's the next prior thing. What the You have a KO on this? No, you do not! No, you do not, but you must be really low in cards. No way. 160. I mean, I'm barely still be alive with this. Alright, we're gonna hit him with this next uh, now turn. Dark Leave. I'm alive. Hi, Goose Lord. You're going down. I'm charging you up, man. Parallel City. You have to throw off these two. You have to throw off those two. And that will reduce that discard's damage as well. Now this isn't gonna get me much, but I can still thin my hand out and get stuff. Send out Miss Lele. She is I, I want her I want this to activate. Uh I don't want to activate that just yet. Let's go ahead and for an end. I'll be able to pull some cards. Uh, should I want to throw this out here? No, it's not time to use that card. Okay, I, I wish baton. I really want that wish baton to come. Shoot. 
All right, don't worry. We have double berry masters. We have double berry masters. We have double, right? I probably may need that card eventually. Probably could should have thrown that card out. Wow, that's bad. Energy drive. All right. I really want to get the wish baton out there, but maybe with the next berry master we'll be okay. And take a look at the ends remainings. I think I uh oh one two. Three, four. We don't have any ends left. We don't have any Shana, so we we're gonna we're close to decking out. And he pulled out the card. He won it. Oh no. We gotta get you now. We gotta get you. I just at this point I won't can't charge up Goose Lord anymore because he's finishing this off. Since he finished that card off, there's no choice. There's no choice. I can't lose nothing at this point. Let's see, this is 170 hit points, okay. Yeah, I can't afford to wish Baton charge us up now. Maybe I can. I can't let you get away from me. Who needs DCE? At this point, probably Lele does. Coconut Master. I could throw down for the extra damage. Like, why not, right? Why not? You don't need the extra damage, though. Let's go ahead and use Riot as beating, then. Trickster GX, copy your own Guzzlord. Ah, I wish you could do that. But this thing looks very wicked, so I'm gonna use Riot as beating. Sink this down. Should carry most of his energies. Yeah, take two prize cards. That's what I needed. And the, this right here. So one prize card, I don't think I... Yeah, yeah, he's not gonna risk it with that. So, we have a really good hand. You could try to end that away, but I have double berry master. It's gonna be really tricky. But that is definitely what you should do. We have double berry master. Taking away the stadium, finally! It's like, yes, I'm free! Oh well, this was a tough match. Gonna send out the, this Dark Rye energy. Can he get the one shot? I don't think so. I think we countered them pretty well. We countered them pretty well. So we just need a sync this right here. I, that's it. Uh oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. You might have enough energies. Nine. He needs one more. He needs one more damage. Oh, that's a KO! That's a KO! Oh, he got me good. I wouldn't say that. I had the tankiest guy out there. But, yeah. One turn away. I would've... I would've Guzma that out there and finished him off. You have enough... But, you know, I guess... He doesn't know. He doesn't know. One, two... Ten. Yeah, that's a KO. He has ten energies. Dark Pulse. One shot. One turn too late. Poor Goose Lord. Was prized up that game. But that was a good patch. That was good. GG. Woo! Good game. Well, are you listening to this? You must have really liked Gus Lord, huh? I really like Gus Lord. So, thank you. Congratulations. You made it to the end. It's time we rate this deck. Let's break it down. Unique trait. What is your unique trait and what kind of score we can give that? You know, this is the biggest one. I mean, other hit points, other Pokemons have this many hit points. Other Pokemons can do this damage. But this right here, the Glutton GX, that's one of a kind. The two extra, extra free prize card is absolutely a killer reward. It is amazing. If you pull it off, you will be so, so ahead. Victory is always in sight. So, this is huge. Two extra prize cards. And for that, we're going to give you a 5 out of 5. It's just that good. All right, rating us, damage rating. All right, for most of your Pokemons, they will pulling off, uh, be pulling up two shots attacks. You do have a one shot somewhere coming from this big tyrannical hall, but that's about it. It's two shot all the way, so you can get this big glutton GX reward. So yeah, that's how it works. Uh, setup, setup. I'm gonna give it a five out of five. Does it set up reliably? Yeah, Zorark is very easy to set up. I mean, you just need a double close energy. Or two Darkness Energy, you go first, you can do full damage easily with Zora R. 
Can you set up Dark Rite easily? Yeah! It has this effect. You can use Max Elixirs. Getting these Pokemon to fight is easy. Getting Guzzlord up, you know, depends on how well your opponent manages you. So, what else? Uh, okay, set up. Yeah, you have a lot of ways to help your energies. Low energy cost Pokemon as well as Max Elixirs. Uh, and a ton of energy item management. Poke tool management. Defense! How is the defense here? The, this is a little weak. 180. A lot of Pokemons can one-shot this. But that's okay. You got a backup plan after this. Still, in prize cards-wise, your defense is average. Yeah. Compared if you know, many other decks won't have too much of a problem dealing with this. It's just if they can handle the offensive power of Guzzlord once you get it up. So defense-wise, you're using plenty of GX Pokemons. You're vulnerable to big extreme damage, so average still. They're quite tanky themselves. Okay, rating. Why are you giving this a 10 out of 5? You should definitely, definitely try Guzzlord once. It's one of the most fun experiences in Pokemon. There are very few cards that can, that, you know, just are out there that make it like, yeah, I pulled this off. It feels great. It feels totally, totally great. Totally fresh. To, to be able to pull a Guzzlord off. So this Pokemon is what we're trying to... This is one of the best things you got, man. Alright, so, Guzzlord! You totally you know, did something new for me that you know, other decks have not been able to do. So, that's why I'm giving you a 10 out of 5. Something big. Alright, now, weakness! Weakness is probably two removals. The two removals at the right time will definitely slow a Guzzlord setting up. And upgrades, there are other variants too. There are other ways to set up a Guzzlord. I'm gonna give you some hint, you know, info right now. So, here's one way you can do it. You could also use Radicate. I mean, he knows no energy, so all your energies can go into Guzzlord. However, getting to Guzzlord, oh man, you need 10 energies to do that. But I, I guess if you uh, use Wish Batons on your Guzzlords, yeah, with rats, you can probably focus all your energies on that. You'll see Guzzlord much more often. What else? You could also use Golduck Break. Gold up. Okay, they evolved three times into this card right here. Hyper transfer. You can move energies wherever you like, so just build up your energies normally, and then you will move energies onto the Guzzlord. Mmm, and Guzzlord's retreat's pretty bad, so we could also use Silvalai too. So Silvalai. Yeah, free retreats for your Guzzlord. Other alternative ways, but I think this one is the most simplest direct route. Just use items. And just fight normally. You know, have a good powerful early game with powerful GX Pokemons. Alright, that is it. What is up for next time, Donald? We could do Silvalai. We could just do Silvalai. Or I could do something else. I could do uh, Faramosa too. I don't know. We'll see. It's one of those two. We'll see what you guys want. Alright, that is it. You know, Let me know in the comments. Faramosa or Silvalai? I'll actually make a straw poll in the description too. Mm, okay, so you can pick the next video. Alrighty then, so! Oh, wait, 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 that's it. That's it! Now, thank you, Integrals. Thank you, Differentials. Please like, subscribe, because you know you want to see more Pokemon videos just like this. Alright, if you follow me on social media, I'll give you hints when new things are coming. Mm -hmm. You can chat with me on Discord or uh, everyone else here that you see, on, you see on the videos. We hang out on Discord. What else? Uh, the link, the link to the Discord is right above my head. Remixes can be found on iTunes, Spotify. If you like, listen, you like the, what you like to hear the, the remixes in the videos. They're all there. New ones just, where well, I just where they're included. They're at the bottom of the playlist link I have. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Next video is tomorrow, of course. Between could be Fairmost and Silver Eye. And I think that's it. Oh yeah. I do other, uh, do other channels on the side. You really want to know what I do all day? Vlog. I got a Vlog channel, and I also play other games on the side too. So, yeah, yeah, I'm doing Assassin's Creed right now. We'll see what other fun games are uh, after this, but yeah, we're getting to the good part. Anyways, that is it for now. Thank you to Gross and the Frenchels. I'll see you guys next time for another Pokemon GX, Crimson Invasion GX. Thank you. Bye bye.